All right, our Saturday chef is the executive chef from Winsett Farms, Ned Bell. Thanks for being here. Thank you very much for having me. And uh, you're cooking us up, uh, cooking us up some vegan tacos today. Now, there's a lot of vegetarian, vegan alternatives out there. I hear about it a lot. Is it increasing in popularity? You know, I'm lucky I have a number of titles, and of course, uh, Winsett, and also uh, at the Four Seasons Hotel, where I'm also the executive chef. We just launched a, ve a whole vegan menu, lunch and dinner. And the focus on that is, is people are looking for alternatives. They're right. looking for things that are different to, you know, a, 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 in, the, in the throw it was all about meatless, right? I mean, people want to eat healthier, they want to eat lighter, they want to have, they want to enable themselves to be more active, of course, in Vancouver. And we, uh, we've come up with these vegan, and, and, uh, vegan lunch and dinner menu items and they're just amazing. And of course, you know, things like avocados, power foods, mm -hmm. um, which I'm gonna get you to help me with, okay. please. Now, these ones magically came already cut. <gasps> I don't know how I that happened. I love that. I know. And they're it? beautiful inside. And, and they're, it's like someone checked them. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> someone made sure they weren't all ugly and black inside. Exactly, exactly. That's good. So. Um, what, you know, the easiest thing Now, are to these do. two different kinds of avocados? Are they different in the size of the No, they're, the... they're, they're like uh, apples often. They're okay. different sizes right. and things like that. Um, so the star of the show is our, is our uh, heirloom-style symphony tomatoes, which are a new product from Winset Farms, and they're available at Costco, so they're great. Obviously, different colors, different textures. Um, they're quite beautiful to look at. They make great salads. But in, in our vegan tacos, mm -hmm. they're... Uh, they're crispy, they're crunchy, they're sweet, uh, and they, they go along with the, uh, with the luscious, luxurious avocado. I'm getting dirty here. I hope that's you good. noticed that that's uh, why That's I'm, very good that I'm you're doing, doing, that. doing that. Now, for you. I want to talk about these tomatoes a little bit. Uh, yep. Lots of different colors. Are they different flavors as well? Um, they're, they're very similar in flavor. Uh, the color often is, is, is just a different variety. Um, I wouldn't say that you would notice a different flavor, but certainly in some heirloom tomatoes, they are... Uh, they're different flavors. The great thing about, for me, is this, they look so gorgeous. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it's very pretty. So They're if you neat. could, if you could get forking, yes, <coughs> please. Do that. Um, it's like I'm making lunch for my nine month old. Well, yeah, fair enough. I mean, <laughs> my little boy Max loves, uh, loves avocado. Yeah, Just, what happened to my sous chef today? Your sous chef, yeah. Unfortunately, the little guy is very sick. He's Aww. sitting at home sick with his mommy and he, uh, Max. He got really dehydrated. And I hope so you're he's... feeling better, Max. Yeah, I hope you're feeling better too, buddy. Um, so I'm going to get the tomatoes. Oh, look, it's like they've come on a plate. I don't need the golf balls that Jay got me, but <laughs> I'll put those aside. He really um, was rubbishing you about your golf game. He right? was, but you know what? Bring it, Jan Hour. I, you know, at one point in my life, I was a six. So uh, I'd, wow. love to, I'd love to throw down with you any day. Um, All right, I have Tegan's lunch ready. There, there you go. <laughs> so I'm going to start just actually throwing right in the halved and or quartered tomatoes, okay. the heirloom style symphony tomatoes. The thing I love about Winset products is they're all they all have musical notes that that uh, are named are, are the product the products are named after. If you Something see from musical. my from my canning my jars, these are maestro peppers, gusto peppers. Those are concerto tomatoes. Those are crescendo peppers, all that, all that I've... Crescendo. Uh, all, exactly. Sort of like our, our incredible pianist that was on Wasn't earlier. Wasn't she amazing? Oh, my goodness. Not only is she, she cute, she was extraordinarily talented. Amazing. Yeah. She's got a future ahead of her. Absolutely. So, um, I think that looks pretty darn good. We, uh, now... <clears throat> You know what we're going to do? What are we going to do? We're going to bust open some of these gusto peppers because I like my food spicy. Lynn, do you like your food spicy? I am a, I'm a half spicer. You're a half spicer. Yeah, so don't go crazy on Okay, mine. I won't go too crazy, but we've pickled these, and pickling, of course, is just salt, sugar, and vinegar. Same, so, in some, the same portion? No, more vinegar and then mostly uh, sugar, about two, two to one sh uh, sugar to salt. Okay and then vinegar, so we'll just throw in some. Now is it true that if you don't put the seeds in, it's not as spicy? It is very true, yeah. I wouldn't want to lick my fingers at this point, that's for sure, because the seeds are incredibly spicy. That's, you know, that's where if you just have the body of the pepper, right. uh, gusto, uh, the outside of it, so to speak, you'll have the flavor, but you won't have as much of the spice. Okay. So we'll continue chopping some. Don't you love my cutting board? I love your cutting board. It's pretty cool, eh? Some uh, scallions. Of course, the recipes are available online if you want to go and see 
Winset the recipe Farms. were to, well, I think your your website or, or website. also yeah, uh, we'll post it. Also Winset Farms. Where did you get that cutting board? It is very cool. I made it. Well, we made it, <laughs> I should say. Um, we we love to do things farm to table at uh, you restaurant at the Four Seasons. So a little bit of lemon juice. There we go. Nice. Lemon juice to I think we need a little more pepper. Maybe Just we should stirring taste a lot. It. I think we should taste it. I think okay. you always got a taster for yeah, we need a little, little That's salt. Rock salt? That is a Malden salt, so it's just it's more of a flaked sea salt. Mm. It's quite spectacular. And, that and is? this is a Japanese spice called togarashi. Again, to add a little bit of uh, togarashi. Add a little bit of spice to the dish. So, what is? It? Can you buy it like like this as you, togarashi? You, yeah, absolutely. It comes like that. It's it's a it's a classic spice. It's got nori in it, black sesame, Japanese chili pepper, orange peel. It's it's really amazing. All right. Um, oh, we're a little behind. We now. are a little behind, but that's okay. Okay. Here we go. So, we're gonna go a little bit on the bottom. A little bit. We'll just Inside. maybe we'll just do one taco, and you can get the idea. Okay. Wow. Taco for Lynn Collier, <laughs> like so. That's good. Yeah. A little bit of radish. Some radish. Look at this. Doesn't this look sexy, vegan? It looks fantastic. I love the way you're flinging stuff around. I know. I'm just. Set, I'm, I'm getting into it. You know. <laughs> just getting into it. Someone cleans up, don't they? Yeah. There you Very go. Very nice. Wow. Look vegan at that. Taco. Vegan taco. Symphony heirloom style tomatoes from Winset. Very nice, thank you. The lovely Ned Bell, thanks for being here. Very, and you can come to uh, you restaurant at the Four Seasons and try this too. Okay, yeah. I'm going to try it right now. Hold on, hold on. Uh, our recipe is going to be on the website, of course, uh, globaltvbc.com. Look for Saturday morning news, and you'll find all of our Saturday chef recipes. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you. All right, nice let's. To see you.